together a really cool collection of recipes. But basically, you can use this to put together any one. Both photos app and the notes app have a lot of features in them that I think we don't really make the most of. So what we have on the screen here is the iPad that's in my hand, but you could use your phone. So Maya is using her phone. You can use any device that you want. I just happened to come up with an iPad just now to do the capturing ideas on iPad session. So the first thing I want to show you is just a couple of features of photos that I think is cool. So when we open the photos app, and we have all of our photos here, and you can pinch out like that actually show many, many more of them. And on the phone, on the iPad, the interface will be slightly different, but at the same time, you will have a lot of these same things. One of the first things that I think of that's quite cool is the search feature. And what search will do is suggest a lot of things to you, like people, places, if you have place locations, categories, like food. And so this can help you to find those photos. If you maybe have a lot of photos, if you lost one, or you know if it was in the past, or something like that. I type on food here, and all the photos of, that the, the algorithm actually recognizes on food will show. But you notice here also, a recipe comes up. So you can search for recipes in your photos app. Yeah, just through the search feature in photos. So if you open up your photos app <clears throat> and just tap once, yeah, you got it. And then just tap back at the top there. Awesome. Search is the far most right tab. And you see under search, it breaks it down into sections. And if you scroll down, you have places and categories. And look, food is a category. So if you tap on food here, you have 67 photos of food, and you'll notice recipes may or may not also pop up. Anything that it can identify with food as a component will pop up, which is really cool. So this is amazing. It actually knows what it's looking for. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna take a, a, a guess. Here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, gorgeous. And you can use these photos. That's what, yeah, that's wow. Yeah, I like it, yeah. It's, it's deconstructed. <laughs> deconstructed now, but yeah. <laughs> but look, you can, use, you can use these photos, and you can put them in your notes as well as a reference. So you might be making a recipe, or you might have inspo for a recipe. It could be written, or it could be an image, and that's why all this thing about search and photos that people don't realize is that the camera, uh, the, the whole iPhone algorithm, iPad algorithm, it knows what things are. So I'm gonna just try something. This may not work because it's a demo device. I don't know if we have recipes. But in addition to the categories, which we were looking through, you can also just type something. So I'm, I'm gonna type recipe and just see if it has anything. It's going to take us through food, but at the end of the day, it does know that that's the recipe, even though it's not even an Indian. So this is something that might help you, might be useful. Yeah, yeah, right? And um, the next thing to... You can then look up that 